The National Coordinator, Odra People's Congress, OPC, and Are Onokakanfo of Yoruba land, Ghani Adams, has warned the federal government against the high speed of insecurity and the dwindling economy in the, in the country. Ghani Adams made this known during the grand finale of 2022 Oshun Shogbo Festival held in Oshun Grove, Oshogbo, the state capital. Our correspondent, Olasu Komi Ogumoku, completes the report. Oshun Oshogbo Festival is the biggest annual religious festival, which serves as a strong unifying factor among Yorubas and Oshogbo indigents. This year's festival commenced in the early hours of Friday at the Palace of the Ataoja of Oshogbo, Obajimo Olaunipeku, with traditional rites among worshippers and devotees. A sacrificial calabash was then conveyed from the palace to the sacred grove by a votary maid known as Arubaoshu, who is recognized to be a virgin. At the grove site, worshippers and devotees fetch water, using the opportunity to make requests according to their own belief. In his address, Ghani Adams said that the annual fiesta ranks among the most celebrated festivals in the southwest. He used the opportunity to call traditional rulers in the region to promote the various festivals in their respective communities. This situation is worsening by the rising insecurity across the country with the terrorist group like Boko Haram, Israel, ISIS, killing and destroying the foundation of this country. The sliding and inconsistency in the federal government program in another major factors that affected the Nigeria economy. It is obvious that President Muhammad Buhari too allude to have a full gas of the anonymity and complexity of the social economy challenge bedeviling Nigeria. The way forward is this, uh, the governor of the Southwest to support OPC. It's not easy for OPC to just go to the bush and fix the, the bandit or the kidnapping out without the consent of the governors of a state or uh, the others. It's not easy for us. We are ready to support the entire Southwest zone in terms of security. But what is happening now is that we need the support of the governors of Southwest and the entire upper of this community. That's all. On his part, the state governor, Boega Oyetola, who was represented by the secretary to the state government, Wale Oyebamiji, noted that the state government is mindful of the economic importance of the festival. The governor, I think Boega Oyetola, is for the people to continue to live in peaceful coexistence. Living in peaceful coexistence allows for progress and for development. The moment we live in peace, we shall continue to progress. And our appeal to the people is that this government is their government. And we are in government. And we, we request for their support and cooperation as they have done in the last three and a half years. Foreigners at the event also spoke on significance of the festival. This festival, uh, actually, I came to celebrate uh, love, prosperity, multiplication, uh, everything what I want in my life. Uh, I really want to like to come here every year uh, because uh, the, this festival is a uh, really amazing and. It's good to see a lot of people how to celebrate uh, life, love, everything. The Ataoja of Oshogbo Obajimo Olao Nipeku, traditional chiefs, representatives of political leaders, among others, grace the occasion. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.